Howdy, y'all. Brandy Lynn Kelly here with just a little tip that we learned, uh, you know, how to get some unlimited loot if you're a loot goblin like myself. So we're going to go ahead and dive right into it now. And just give it a second, it's going to load. But I don't know about y'all, one, one of the things that made me nervous about Sunken Land was I learned that the loot doesn't respawn. So when you, for the most part, loot a container, they disappear. So what my community had uh, figured out, and we figured we share with everybody, is uh, how to get unlimited loot. So essentially all you have to do, and it's really simple honestly, just don't loot everything in, in its entirety, right? So here I'm going to scavenge this a little bit. Right before it hits the end, I'm going to go ahead and stop, and we're going to move on to the next item down here. We'll go down to this car, get a little bit more scrappy for us, you know? Um, oop, don't do that. Uh, so, you know, you just want to get it to where you're still leaving at least one item there for you to loot later, right? So we'll come here, you know, get the laundry at, stop, and then this right here, our first loot container, right? So we come in here, got a can of tuna. You know you need the tuna. I don't really need either one of those items, so I'm going to leave it. But let's just say, right, that we looted this and there was only the can of tuna. Make sure you leave something uh, like a scrap or anything just to make sure that the barrel or container stays there. Gotta catch some breath. I'm pretty notorious for dying by drowning, but that's all right. Okay, so, essentially we've looted, uh, you know, everything in there. Not fully, but you know, we got a little bit of loot. Got some loot in our pockets. So now all you have to do, ladies and gentlemen, is log out, right? You save, you log out. You don't even have to do a full restart, it's just uh, log out, okay? Now, what you do is you hit your start game, create your game, and then you go in here and you create it one more time. Now, we should have pockets full of loot, right? And ideally what should happen is, um, if it works the way it's intended anyways, uh, this, uh, this little scrap pile here um, should really only have one piece of loot left in it, right? Because we mostly got it, but there you go. Same just as before. Catch my breath here now. Go get check the car quick, see if it's the same. Same thing, look at that. More loot for mama. Now, let's come back in here. Can I get my laundry? Good thing, got me some cloth. Okay, now, go check this. And would you look at that, got me a soda pop. Don't need the charcoal. Ladies and gentlemen, that is how you get unlimited loot. And it works in a group setting too. In case you didn't know this and you play with multiple players, everybody can have their own instance of loot. Y'all just need to leave one item in there. I would always keep something on you, you know, that's worthless. Um, but really, you could have unlimited loot uh, as long as you don't open the barrels fully or loot all the items fully. Uh, we're going to come down here to the apartments real quick. And it works with any lootable container. Um, you know, like these big, uh, these are my favorites, the big looty boxes, you know, like the trash cans, the blue tarps. Uh, but every time I'll show you one more example with this. Uh, but yeah, you know, just leave whatever item in there. It doesn't matter what you leave, just as long as one item is left. You know, if you want to keep a pocket full of, uh, full of junk, you know, you can, but. Yeah. So that essentially, ladies and gentlemen, is how you're going to get your unlimited loot. And, you know, keep the apartments plentiful because that's that's the best loot in the spot personally in the beginning in my opinion so every time you just need that loot you know just log out log it back in and boom it's going to be unlimited loot for you so you don't have to worry about you know essentially not having uh you know not having enough loot or running out treating the game like it's hardcore mode because uh, every time now you'll have different loot so just takes a little reboot Ladies and gentlemen, if you enjoy this video, you know, do the things, like, comment, whatever. Uh, and if you're curious about what I look like, you want to hear more content from me, I do stream live on Twitch. I'll put that in the description for you as well. Well, that's keeping it simple. Stupid with Brandy Lynn. I appreciate y'all. Until the next video, we'll see you. Have a good one.